Okay, Rough Rider is going to be the theme. And this is what I made. Listen, I looked at several videos and I did a little bit of adjusting. This is what I came out with. Remember, I'm using what I have at my house. So the colors may be off a little bit, but let's get started. You ready? Let's make this motorcycle. Okay, so I'm going to be forming my wheel and I'm going to be using this pot because this is the size I want my wheel. So I'm going to start by putting a diaper in here and I'm just going to do it one by one. I know a lot of people put them in there and put a lot of them in there, but I'm going to do them one by one and try to make sure that I get them kind of evenly spaced to start. And I do it by putting it in the back of the one before it, okay? That's the way I did it. Because I did it another way and I didn't like the way it looked, so. Putting it in the back, just spinning it around, going all the way around. So I have one already. And I have 18 in there. And I'm going to use 18. In this one, and the reason I used this pot because it was the size that I wanted it to be. So you could do it any size. These are size two diapers from Walmart because that was the smallest size they had. I looked for ones. I looked for um, newborn. What was the smallest size they had in these generic diapers? Cause I wasn't gonna use, get no good ones and do this and I didn't know what the heck I was doing. So we're gonna get 18 in here. Just start getting tight toward the middle. Just try to keep it neat. Again, I'm going in behind, behind. And I did it one by one. I saw where they, some people spread them out and I couldn't do that. It didn't look right to me. Mine didn't look right, not the other, not the people videos I saw. I'm just going down there, making sure, make it to the bottom, making sure it's behind the one in the front of it, and making sure it's evenly all the way, even all the way down. As I get in there, it gets tighter to get them in there. Still want to make it as neat as you did when you first started. On diaper number one and two. You want diaper number 18 to be the same way. So you have to kind of work with it when it gets tight in there. I'm going to got two more to go. One more after this. Okay, I'll take this one, I'm going to roll it, and put it in the center. Okay, so I got my wheel, my base made. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is get the diapers out, and the way I do it, I'm going to do it with a rubber band. This is a pretty loose one. And I'm just going to put it inside around the uh, diapers. Making sure it get in there and around all of them so when I take them out they don't fall apart. I'm just going to take this out like a cake. Flip it over. Okay, so we have our diaper cake, and I mean our diaper wheel, and of course this is not tight, so I told you I used a loose one to get out, so I'm going to get a tighter rubber band and put it on here once I make sure it's like I want it, and it is. Get a tighter one, i put around, okay. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and take this one off. I'm going to go ahead and 
sliding this one up. Okay, so we got our two tires. About the same size. And we're going to get ready to put ribbon around one of our tires going the same way. So we're going to put ribbon around it. But I wanted to talk you through that. The rest of it, we can just let you look at it till we get to another spot. Oh crap, I knocked over water. Hold on, hold on. Okay, so I changed the ribbon. Of course, you can see that I changed the ribbon because it was a little bit too fancy for. Yeah, I just changed the ribbon. I'm going with what I have at the house, so a lot of stuff won't match, but if I can get it to look halfway decent, I will. So I'm turning it. To where I taped it. And the reason I taped it is in case somebody want to use the diapers. These for my daughter. She probably won't use them. But if you're going to do it for a client, you want to make sure that everything is sanitized when you're making these things in case your client use them. So you want to make sure not on nothing like this. But my daughter won't use these. So I'm going to take this red ribbon and I'm going to go through the center. Where I folded up that one diaper in the middle, I'm going to go through the center and I'm going to bring it through. Then I'm going to go through the center of the other one. I'm making sure my ribbon is. Not twisting. So I'm gonna take my ribbon and I'm gonna tie it together. Make sure it's even, get a little bit more even. Then I'm going to take this and I'm going to twist it around. Oh my goodness. All this stuff. I should have did this before, but oh well. Better late than never. If you're going to use some glitter, go ahead and put some. This hairspray. See how that glitter in. Roll it off of here. Let me get it off my table. Once I do that, you know what I should have really did is. Take one wheel, a big wheel, and one um, a small wheel, so they had a hot rod. But anyway, so next I'm gonna take these bibs, and I'm gonna lay them across the two wheels. You can actually use a burping pad for this portion of it. I just happen to have these two Dollar Tree bibs. Then I'm gonna take. This is going to be the handlebars, so I'm going to go roll this. I'll be right back. I'm going to roll it the longest route, the longest way. Okay, so I've got this um, 
the blanket rolled. And again, I'm just using what I have. You definitely want to get yours and get the colors right and match everything. I'm going to put that bottle up there. Give me a second. So I'm going to go back through this hole. And this is going to be the front of my motorcycle. So these are the handlebars. So I'm going right back through that middle portion. I'm going to get it even. I'm stretching it. Get cloth um, things, bibs. Next, I'm going to sit the bottle on that front tire, and that's going to be my headlight. Then I'm going to use the blanket to make the handlebars. I used a rubber band on the blanket to make the handlebars. Then I kind of formed the handlebars after I got the rubber band on. Then I used a pair of socks on the end of the handlebars so that would um, simulate the gear shifter because the gear shifter is on the handlebars. And that's basically the motorcycle. You're going to go back and form and make sure everything is straight. I believe on these handlebars, you can use floral wire, the thick floral wire on the inside of the blanket to make it bendable so you can form it the way you want it. But yeah, this is the motorcycle. Okay, thank you so kindly for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I have a lot of baby stuff that I'm making along with my regular crafts because... I am going to be a grandmother in September. My daughter, my oldest daughter is pregnant with a boy. She plans on naming him Ryder. So the theme for the baby shower is Rough Riders and they're using motorcycles. So that's why I made this craft. Let's see the finished product. While you're looking at this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that follow button, hit that like button, leave a Comment and I'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you.